KFNN. Headline News Update. Welcome, folks. We have the Dow Industrials finished down 176, NASDAQ down 86, S&P's off 33. And if you're wondering, like, how this went down so quick, folks, at the, at the uh, close, the bottom line is that we have volatile markets. But what you also had is that you had several, Sheryl Sandburn uh, just resigned as the C, uh, CEO or CFO. Uh, bottom line is that that took 10 points off uh, Facebook at about a heartbeat, which uh, brought the uh, NQs in and the Dow down. Gold, gold contract out here up $2.30, trading at 1850 an ounce. You had silver up 18 cents, $21.87 an ounce. Light sweet crude up uh, 49 cents, trading $115.16 a barrel, notes and bonds. The 10 year down 24 ticks, trading out at a price point of 118.22. The 30 year off 27 at 138.19. The 10 year right now, folks, is uh, bidding, uh, yielding rather. 2.976. Looks to me tomorrow morning we're going to be back in the threes once again. And King Dollar. King Dollar got a good bounce going out here. Up 796 ticks at 102.549. Euro 106. Yen 130.18. And the British pound 124 to 1 US dollar. We get up and we take a look at the S&Ps. What you're looking at here, folks, you get a sideways move. Yeah, we're down, but realistically, this is still a sideways move. 81 million shares traded, you know, bottom line, you know, Thursday, Friday, I suspect we're still going to go sideways. It's, if, if we start heading down tomorrow or the next day, it's really going to be uh, faster than I thought. Uh, most times, folks, when you get, you know, when you take a look at this market, what we have done is this, is that if you go all the way back to March 29th, right, it was a straight line move down March 29th until a week ago. You know, that's a fast move down. So you get a bounce going, you go three days sideways, more than likely you're going to go five days sideways. That will build enough cause to go after the lows, number one, because that's a high volume low that we have that's established out here on the 20th of May. Go after that, and we'll see what's going to be an ABC structure on the way down. We go look at the NDX 100, you get the same setup inside the NDX. NDX out here, bottom line, you uh, did uh, 62 million shares. And that's setting up a bearish engulfing, man. You know, let's say that they, that potential ABC structure down, that B point is game. That's the bottom line. Have a great night, folks. Have a safe night. Come back and visit Tommy tomorrow morning. Kicks us off 9 o'clock in the morning. Great show, folks. Yeah, we'll get him, folks. Sharpening your skills.